Welcome again SpaceX fans. You might have already known that Super Heavy Booster 7 had an anomaly during testing yesterday. This was not intended. Elon Musk himself confirmed it. But the cause is still not confirmed. But what could potentially be a reason might be fuel leakage creating a fuel air explosion. Cryogenic propellants like methane tend to vaporize in just fractions of seconds and could easily ignite with oxidizers from the air. I could be wrong, I am not an expert. Just speculating. Something like this. So Elon with his engineers drove down the highway when the situation calmed down a bit to inspect the launch site. He said the base of the rocket seems okay. But due to safety concerns, the pad will remain closed until the morning. But I am 100% sure they will fix this because SpaceX has some of the greatest engineers the world has right now. But the good part is the booster is standing tall. We all can admit there was some damage caused, but to what extent is the question. I wish all the engines are okay. I don't want to see any damage to the engines seriously. Let's hope the engine shrouds do their job. Hopefully, in the morning, we will get to know more about yesterday's event. What is even more astounding is how strong stage zero is made. They all stood their ground after the explosion. Before ending the video, let's talk about the second explosion which was not related to the booster. It might be something parked between the tower and the test tank booster 7.1, or could it be the diesel generator or this little house? I don't know, if you have any clues comment down below.